Sarah. Well, new this afternoon, while the fate of an East Texas man on death row is still up in the air, this afternoon, family of his killed daughter are speaking out. In a statement to the Texas House Committee on Criminal Jurisprudence, the family says two-year-old Nikki Curtis story is getting lost in recent media attention catering to Robert Robertson. They go on to say, quote, we do not believe Robert Ro Mr. Ro Roberson should be put to death simply because he is a bad man. We believe his death sentence should be carried out based on the facts of this case, which remain true today. Now, her brother, aunt and grandfather believe facts have been intentionally left out surrounding this case. They reiterated those facts presented during the 2003 trial that Nikki suffered injuries, including extensive bruising. The medical examiner testified that Nikki died from blunt force head injuries, not shaken baby syndrome, and that Robertson had a history of sexually and physically abusing his daughter and another girl. They conclude by saying they still believe Robertson is, quote, directly responsible for Nikki's death and they're praying justice will be delivered to Nikki. And after